good morning to you all my dear friends today we have come to diamond english school udalguri where 31st national children's science congress is held so along with our teacher science teacher and two students who have come to participate and the topic is about junk food so now the dishes are have arrived welcome back audience dear audience we are thrilled to have dc of udalgari district among amongst us we feel honored we acknowledge that despite of this schedule you have made yourself available so may we have our dishes sir all of you give a huge round of applause as a sign of welcome on a boy ko hai ko i request us with a man to go in honor This is it. We also have three more dignitaries, three more dignitaries amongst us. That is Mr. Kuldeep Hajariga, ADC Education Department. I'm sorry, Mr. Sanjay Sorgeri, Honorable MCLA BTR. Can you please give him a round, man? <laughs> Mr. Kuldi Bhajarika, ADC Education Department. And following, Mr. Jaipal Brahma, Inspector of Schools. <laughs> Jaipal Singh Brahma.
honorable teachers, honorable faculty members, and dear students. Today we are assembled here for our uh, district science uh, congress. So, as all of you know, this is an important event for our district. All of our achievement, all of our development is based on science. Whatever we have achieved till now, whatever difference we have in our evolution, it's all based on science. I mean, Jimon achievement for you as a, a mankind, as a human race, as compared to other animals, it is absolutely based on science. Good morning, everyone. Asagat sir and madam. Asagat, this is sir and guys and my dear sun scientists. Now I would like to lead the fourth of Silver Science Congress. Please follow me. I, Sri Kipu Boro, to swear under the flag of the National Silver Science Congress. They can you explain? things you have used. The concept here is that uh, there is a light cell. This light gets power from the solar energy cell. Solar energy and the energy gets stored in the battery cell. And the thing is that, suppose this is the national park cell. Okay. And this is the boundary of the national park cell. So in the walls, we place mirrors, sir. Mirror. So that the laser lights get reflected and they fall in this sensor, sir. So if an object tries to obstruct the light, they will fall in this laser, sir.